Hey guys, SkyscraperCraft here, and today I have decided to show you guys one of my best worlds. Um, it's pretty cool, it's just full of awesome things, and yeah. I'll just head to the spawn point, and then we will start the video. Okay, this isn't the spawn point, but who cares? Let's get started anyway. Um, okay, this is my farm, quickly. I'll just grab that. Okay, so this is soapy wood. Um, yeah, I have a burning bridge. I have a burning bridge. This is the VIP house. Shut the doors. And, because that's the VIP house in your world that I did. Unless you're a VIP. Um, let's go along this bridge. As you can see, there's a soapy wood sign up there. And, okay, never mind. Um, here is, here's the spawn point in this pool here. You will spawn somewhere over here, and you'll f automatically float onto this block. And yeah, and if you're new, you go this way. If you just if you're coming back in, you go up this way. This is Sky Hub. It's getting dark. Okay, this is the Sky Hub. This is where just about everything happens that controls this place. Not really, I just thought it'd be cool. Um, sadly, I cannot seem to get up. Um, okay, yep. Now, I'll just sleep up here to give you guys a better view of what happens during the daytime. Uh, okay, yep. Climbing up. And we'll just sleep here. Low battery, whoops. And when you wake up in the morning, I will show you guys the epicness of this place. Um, so, over in this direction, we have the dwarf hole, which, as you may guess, is just a random diggy diggy hole. And people just dig. This is my perfectly straight and perfect hole. And someone else's hole. It's just random all over the place. Yeah. You get the picture. Um, so if we just climb back up here, we will go and look at the village. So, it's just over here. Um, here's some houses. This is actually a bare-handed combat. Bare handed combat. Yeah. Um <clears throat> so here is the public pool which if we just pop up here this is a diving board. Whee Diving board. Sweet. Okay, here we go. Here's a little mini game. Where you jump from wall to wall and you get the picture. Up here, um, I don't know what this is. Um, here's the village, full of houses. Some of them are owned by people. This is my friend David's house. He hates lapis, so I filled his house with lapis the pooly. Um, yeah. He's gonna have such a rage when he comes on. Okay, this is my friend Brock's house. He hates butter, so I put some butter in his chest. This is my friend Mason's house. And in the chest, what did I put in the chest? Okay, I didn't put anything in that 
he hated. Um, in fact, I don't even know what he hates. And here's one that's for sale. As you can see, they're all pretty much the same size. And here is the Trade Center, which is empty because no one's come on yet. But when I have a realm, this will be the realm. And like everyone will be on here. And then we'll have it work in Trade Center. But at the moment, no. Lag spike. Okay. Here is man made waterfall, as you may guess. Now, let's go see the outer attractions. Just hop up here, up again. Uh, it's so laggy, I can't even do my parkour up this thing. Uh, crap. Uh. Okay, okay. Yep, now. Here is like my siege tower. If something just hap if like there's ever massive trouble and we need to hide, this is the place. This is the place. It is like set up with TNT, so we can blow up the ground and I'll just show you quickly. Uh Directly under the ground is okay. I'm not gonna say it. Um, directly underneath is just a big hole, and the TNT will blow up that top layer, and everything will just fall down as it tries to come at us. Um, here is where I always build the nether reactor, and oops. A small mining zone. You can mine in there without getting trouble because there are places that if you mine there, you'll get in trouble. Yeah, here's where I built the nether reactor all the time. If we go along here, we have my small and rather stupid ride. Just a water slide. I'll go down it quickly just to show you guys and it's pretty crappy. We'll just go down here. And yeah. I don't know why. Don't ask me. Don't ask me why. I'm, I'm an idiot. And here is the Soapy Palace. If um, the Deadly Blue Flame is watching, this is what I built. Um, it is made entirely out of soap blocks quartz, glowstone, and these stairs. Oh, and that whatever. Um, yeah. And it is surrounded by cactuses. Okay, so, yeah. I'll show you what else I want to show you guys on this world. There are two more things I want to show you guys. Actually, no, three. Um, we'll just keep going. And... We just keep coming along. You should be able to see. Yep, there it is. That pyramid in the distance. If you go in there, I will rig it up to give you like a prize. If you go in there and get past the traps, um, we'll keep heading this way towards my old faction. Yes, I used to build factions on this world, and I was planning to make this a faction server, and then I decided not to, um, but I decided I would leave this place, because I just think it's really cool. I'll just quickly show you guys, and then we'll be off to the next thing. Um, I've still got to work on getting the water currents. Right. Um, so here's the way in. And I built this in the ways of a Mayan temple. If you walk in, you have to walk through the hollow walls before you actually get inside it. Here we go. It's pretty small and basic. But yeah, it's all you really need. 
Okay, I'll shut that gate behind me. And then we'll be off to show you guys one of the coolest things on this world. It is a glitch taught to me by Jack Frost Miner. You may have heard of him, you may have not. If you have never heard of him, I suggest you go to subscribe. He is really cool. Half the tricks I know, I learnt from him. I'm building a miniature um, jungle biome on that island just for no apparent reason. It's getting dark again. It's okay, because where I'm going, we go bed. Oh, yeah, we got bed. We could head up this way. Yeah, let's go. Uh, uh. Uh, 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 uh,